Okay, so to my online audience, um, I'm Eric Ingheim. Um, so welcome to this talk about RISC-V microprocessors. So I just talked about uh, the word here, genius. So it doesn't mean quantum mechanics or theory relativity or that kind of smart. There's nothing in RISC-V, there isn't anything that's fundamentally new and super clever. So this is more about the kind of things when you, you look at a small piece of code and you think, maybe it doesn't do anything revolutionary or new, but you're thinking, well, that's kind of a very clever or smart way of doing this thing. It's a very neat way of doing it. And that's a lot of what I feel when um, looking at how Risk Five has been put together. It's a lot of existing ideas that exist, but they've been put together in, in a kind of a clever way, a smart way that sort of um, can be impressive. <clears throat> So this is the uh, RISC-V logo. RISC-V actually started sort of its, its life in a way began with RISC-1, which was the first RISC processor design at Berkeley. So a name that you will see pop up in this context is David Patterson, who was the guy that kind of wrote one of the better known um, papers that was arguing for why RISC or reduced instruction set computing was um, or reduce instructions at computer, sorry. Uh, it was a good idea. Uh